small groups can go to an entity like EIW and not only gain experiences and training uh, to enhance their own current skills, but also to allow them to uh, learn about other best practices within other organizations that can help them. And this especially takes place when you look at the amount of time and effort that small business can place into, into their jobs as well as outside activities. Very little for outside activities because everything is focused on being a success. So I guess my vision is that we can enable, you be able to leverage not only the knowledge and the, the people that are going to be involved with EIW, but do it in a way that introduces you to the kind of, of folks that uh, can help you be successful in other areas. A good, a good example of the advocacy. Association of Washington Business, the group I came from uh, prior to my current uh, role as owner of R.E. Walter and Associates, this is a little small business, um, that was uh, one that I really learned that AWB is probably as great an advocacy group for business, big and small, uh, especially since most of the uh, members of them are small business, but they do uh, the kinds of activities that small business couldn't afford, uh, whether it's legal, whether it's legislative, whether it's uh, member services. Uh, so I hope that we can introduce those kinds of relationships to this organization and to the entrepreneurs that become members of it. I hope the uh, Entrepreneurial Initiative for Washington uh, is a platform where people that may have ideas but don't know where to go can go to EIW, uh, discover a place that assists them, not just in forming a company, because that's really the easy part, in entity formation. It's really to grow that company. It's how to manage the business affairs, uh, initially to work successfully on a small project, later to work on larger projects, and to collaborate and communicate with others in our region that also focus on the entrepreneurial spirit. EIW will be working hard to help small businesses put together their comprehensive plans so that they can provide a full service, if you will, as a small business. They might have an expertise uh, that has to do with a specific trade as an example, but their challenge then has become how to run a business. And that's what I see the vision doing is helping these businesses, small businesses, work in a comprehensive way to provide services rather than just one piece of the service providing process. I envisualize EIW in being able to mentor a small business entrepreneur to be able to give them direction in how to grow their business, how to be excellent at dealing with others in the business community, not doing business as usual, but business unusual. How to be integrous, how to be a good steward over what they have, how to be responsible, how to treat others, how to give excellent service, and know that it's not the bottom line, it's not the dollar, but the bottom line is being who you say you are and always following through. My vision of the future of EIW really is a more educated uh, business owner, uh, more entre uh, a more educated business leader. Uh, my hope is that through EIW, businesses will be able to reach their potential. They will be able to take this knowledge uh, that has been provided to them and be able to use that to harness and grow their businesses and be able to be a catalyst for other businesses and be able to give back to those businesses that have supported them. So my hope and my vision and future is we're going to create some million dollar businesses and we're going to create thousands of jobs through the membership and the, the tremendous effort of our advisory board and sponsors uh, over the next 10 years. That's what my, the future of EIW is in my words.